OK, I've got to prove that the expression on the left-hand side is always equal to the expression on the right-hand side. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the expression on the left-hand side, these three brackets. I'm going to expand them. And I'm going to hope that at the end of the day, I end up with an expression which is the same as the expression on the right-hand side. I'm going to start I'm copying down the first of these and just expand these second two brackets. That's going to be x squared plus 2x minus 35. And now I'm going to multiply the second bracket by the first. I'm going to do 3x multiplied by everything in the second bracket. So let's do that first. So 3x times x squared, 3x cubed, 3x times 2x. 6x squared, 3x times 35 is minus 135, I'm sorry, minus 105x. So that's 3x multiplied by everything in the second bracket. And now I'm going to do plus 2 multiplied by everything in the second bracket. So I'm going to end up with plus 2x squared plus 4x minus 70. Okay, and now I'm going to simplify this expression and hope that it equals the expression on the right hand side of the question. Let's have a look. 3x cubed, no more x cubed, so that's 3x cubed, plus 6x squared, plus 2x squared, is plus 8x squared, minus 105x, plus 4x is minus 101x, and then I've got minus 70 at the end, and let's just have a look. 3x cubed plus 8x squared minus 101x minus 70. Good. So I have proved that the left-hand side is always equal to the right-hand side.